Even Dollar Fit Friday with Jenna and Sarah. Today we are going to be showing you some exercises that are going to work our chest and our tricep muscles. Woo! All right. So we're going to start with everybody's favorite push-ups. Yeah. So we're going to want to get down on the ground. So we've got three ways of doing our push-ups. So I'll actually start and showing the standing way, the one that's the easiest to do if you're not feeling it. So you can find a wall and put your hand about shoulder width apart on the wall along with your feet. Like and then this. you're going to bend at the elbows and bringing your chest closer to the wall and then you'll straighten. So this is one modification of our push-up. The next ones we can do is we can do push-ups on our knees. So we'll keep our knees on the ground and have our hands shoulder width apart, our palms underneath our shoulders, and then bending at the elbows, bringing our whole body down towards the ground. And then if you're feeling up to it, the most advanced ones we can do is bringing our feet up and having our whole body off the ground and then bending down. All righty. So pick which push-up you want to do today, and we are going to do 10 push-ups together. Alrighty, we'll go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. All right, those are top. Next one we're going to do, if you want to use weights, we're going to grab weights for this exercise, and we're going to do a chest press. If you don't have weights, that's okay, and if you want to add something that is a little bit more weight, you can grab some soup cans if you have those at home or some water bottles. Um, otherwise, no weights is fine too. All right. So for this one, we're going to lie down on our backs with our feet close to our butts, like our position for crunches. And then if we have weights, we'll grab a weight in each hand. And we're going to put our elbows on the floor, having our arms in that goal post position. And then we're going to straighten our elbows up towards the ceiling and then bring them back down towards the ground. So together we're gonna to do 10 of these. Your elbow should be in line with your shoulders. All right, let's go together. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. All righty. You can go ahead and stand back up. Next one we are going to do is tricep dips. So you're going to want a chair for this exercise. So if you have a chair or a stool, just make sure it doesn't have wheels on it because we're going to have to be, start sitting on your chair and we're going to put our arms right next to our butt and then grab onto that end of the chair with your hands. Then we're going to scooch our feet out. So we're kind of in like a 90 degree position with our legs and then we're going to bend down at our elbows and our shoulders and push straight up. So we're going to do 10 of those too. All right, so one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, ten. Good job. All, All right. right. One last exercise for you. We get the chairs out of the way. We don't need them anymore. Girl. <laughs> and we are going to do some overhead tricep presses. 
So again, you don't need a weight for this one, but if you want to use one, that is fine. So with a weight, you are going to grab onto that weight with both hands, and we're going to hold the weight up over our head, and then we're going to lower that weight by bending at the elbows, bringing the weight closer to our back, and straightening back up towards the ceiling. So if you don't have a weight for this one, what you can do is just clasp your hands together, and then bend at the elbows, bringing your hands closer to your back, and straightening back up. All right. So let's do this one together. We got 10. So we're going to lower. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good Great job. job, you guys. So what you're going to want to do now is you're going to want to go back to the beginning of this video and repeat two more times so that you do it a total of three times. And then you are all done with your chest and tricep workout today for this week's Fit Friday. We'll see you guys next week.